Hey, everybody, it's Coach Rebecca. I One of the things that I wanted to talk with you about is how accepting of yourself are you? Are you, do you give yourself grace if you mess up? Do you give yourself leeway if you don't reach uh, a goal at the time that you think you should? I just want to know, are you creating an atmosphere for yourself that you accept yourself, which shows that you love yourself? A lot of times when we're very critical of our own selves, we tend to be critical of people out there, are critical of our work critical of of whatever we're creating because we're not starting with ourselves first. This this just comes to me in thinking about how can I love myself better? Because when I know I do that, then I'm able to to be more creative, to show up like that person who loves what they're doing and is excited about what they're doing. And if I mess up, I mess up and I just start again. But we've got to start with accepting who we are. And then in that same realm, then let's go, okay, I would like to be a little bit better at doing this. I'd like to be better at doing videos. I'd like to be better at doing offers. I would like to be better at X, Y, Z, whatever that might be for you. So accept where you are, accept who you are, and then work on how you can elevate that area of your life. You know, these are the things I do with my clients. We look at where they, uh, the areas of their life that isn't up to the level where they would like it to be. We look at why that might be and then visualize where they see themselves. And then let's just get a strategy going. How are you going to get there? What do you need to do to increase that belief that that is where you want to be? You can accept your process along the way and you can continually love yourself through the journey because it's all a journey. It's what we're going to be doing every single day. And how much greater do you already feel just thinking, okay, I love me. I love what I'm doing. I'm accepting where I am. Now let's go rock the day.